Hello, this is Tony Hiller from RealClimateScience.com, the climate guy setting the record straight about climate. In this video, I show how NOAA claims record heat in regions where they have no actual thermometer data. Yesterday, NOAA tweeted this bright red map and they claimed September 2017 global land surface temperature was third highest for the month. On their website, they claimed record warmth in September observed across parts of Central and Southern Africa. You can see that with these dark red squares. Let's take a closer look at that. This is their map on their website, and you can see how hot Africa was. But on the right is a much less prominent map on their website, which shows their actual thermometer data. Note what this map says down here. Gray areas represent missing data. Now let's look at record hot Central and Southern Africa. Well, all they had there was missing data. They didn't have any actual thermometer readings over here where they were claiming record heat. This is all fake. And if we look at the total land area, we can see that most of it is either gray, which means it's missing, or blue, which means it was below normal temperatures. So this impression of dark red, which they're trying to create, is fake. This animation shows how they fake the data in Central and Southern Africa. So how can we evaluate what temperatures actually were in this region where NOAA had no thermometer data? A good way to do that is to look at satellite data, which covers almost the entire planet. This satellite imagery from the University of Alabama in Huntsville for September shows that Central and Southern Africa was either normal or just above normal temperature. There wasn't any record heat there. The NOAA claims are completely fake, and they do this month after month. The whole global warming scam is junk science based on fake data from government agencies. Visit Toto on the web at realclimatescience.com. He's been pulling back the curtain on junk science for a long time.